Hello everybody, my name is Mike from Ed Gaming, and welcome to Dreadout 2. Now, I never actually played the original Dreadout game, but essentially Dreadout is an Indonesian survival horror game, think Fatal Frame, but for millennials. What I mean by that is, in Fatal Frame you used an old camera to take pictures of ghosts, in Dreadout you used your mobile phone to take pictures of ghosts and demons. Now there is a story before trailer thing, I'm not going to watch it through, I will essentially sum up the story of Dreadout for you in a couple of sentences. Friends get lost, friends find haunted place, all friends apart from main character die, main character releases demon. There we go, that's pretty much it. So yeah, that's the story before, I'll get straight into this. So yeah, the demon thing that was released was a snake. Which is why on the bottom of the screen you'll see snake scales. It's essentially like you defeated all of the demons in this place. But those demons were actually guardians for a bigger demon thing. And that's what you ended up releasing. So now we're having to deal with this, the shit that we released before. And it's based on this. Some old cultures believed the photographs could steal a person's soul and disrespected the spiritual world. Like that one snapshot of a person is that person. And it's kind of creepy if you think about it. <laughs> Genuinely creepy. Not that funny. Linda? Linda? Linda's the woman that works at the hairdressers. Oh, hi, Linda! Is this Linda? Hiding in a locker? We're we gonna be doing a lot of this. Oh no, she's coming out. She's coming out the closet. It's a teenage coming out story. And she's barely dressed, which is... Why is it with school kids and short skirts and hardly wearing anything? You don't get cold. Don't type OK Boomer in the chat. Prologue. Guilt. Well, yeah. Guilt because all our mates died. Like, here they are. <laughs> guys, I hope you're all rest in peace. I know I've got to find the answers to all this. Yeah, these guys all died. So, but I... Yeah. And then... Linda must die. Die, 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 die. They really do not like Linda. Sorry, Linda. Um, these guys have all got it in for you. I don't have a light or anything. I don't even have a phone. It's very dark. But anyway, with all these series, if you want to see your full playthrough of this, make sure you like the video. Let me know you want to see more. Anyway, it's pitch black here. So let's just follow the light sections. <laughs> Imagine the game's trying to lead me down a set path at the moment. It's so dark. I can't see a thing. Is that a chair on fire? Squeeze me. Linda. No, wait, hang on. There's a bag of st Oh, we can ex okay, we can examine the bag of stuff. My bag. Oh, it's your bag. Okay. How could the how could they throw my bag on the floor and set it on fire? Is that my phone? Oh shit, we can't live without our phone. Oh shut up! Saying Linda. You know you need your hair cut next week, but seriously. Okay, and I think our phone acts as a flashlight as well. It does. So yeah, it's <laughs> it's Millennial Fatal Frame. Because I think... Cat? Where's the cat? Where's the cat? Right mouse button to toggle view mode. There we go, see? And then we take pictures of shit. <gasps> it's a ghost cat! Hello, ghost cat. What the hell are you doing? Meow to you too. It's... Oh, look. Where are we going? Are you hungry? Do you need letting out? Is your litter box full? Cats are so fucking demanding. I've got three. Oh, this, this, this cat can move. Where are we going? Here. Is this where your whiskers is? There are other cat food brands, by the way. What? What, what, what do you want? You want me to go down there? This is my inevitable demise this way. You're right there, mate. 
I take take your picture. Can we take a selfie? That's what we have. Linda? Buddy, I'm sorry, Linda. So, so we tried to give you a lesson for what happened to Ira Shelley, Donnie Yan Yan, and also Miss Siska. Then something bad happened. She's turning crazy. So I gotta lock her up. Yeah, so English isn't the first language in this game. I, if you want to get out, Andre had the key. But I don't know where he is. Mommy, help. I wanna go home. Right, so. It was just a prank, bro. And then. Okay. What? Whoa. Ghostpedia? Wow. Uh, where's my where's my map? We've got notes. Linda's list and notes. It's different apps. Oh my god, this is, this is so fucking millennial. Okay, it says, Buddy told me that Andre has the key to the lobby. Apparently he's hiding somewhere inside a classroom. So, we've got to go searching classrooms. Are you just going to sit there? Yeah, you're just going to sit there, little kitty cat. I mean, this place is absolutely huge. It could literally be anywhere. Okay, so we're back where we were. We go in, no, that's the padlock. That's the classroom, though. Maybe it's my original classroom. Let's try going back up again. There was the dark area. Well, that classroom was completely empty. But then that is where I started, so it does kind of make sense. Ooh, what about this door? This door looks open. <gasps> okay, this one's open. Hello! Ooh! Ghosties. I like ghosties. Ghost is scary. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. What's this? Huh? Some kind of ritual book. A bookmark splits the book to, to a page. Ritual of the Endless Misery. <laughs> what? Build a Jelangkong effigy and put the victim's photograph on its head. Two, make an empty grave and put the victim's photograph at the headstone. Three, ring a bell a thousand times at the grave while chanting the victim's name. So that's what they've done to me, right? They think it's my fault that their friends died. They don't know about the ghosty gobs, then. Right. Well, fuck you guys. I hope you all die, too. You sons of bitches. Well, that's locked. Let's just check down the end of the hallway, anyway. Locked. Locked. Now we can go that way, but let's not. Stairs we go, then. Oh. It's a sheet. Look, it's a, it's a bed sheet. Oh, it's not actually the ghost. Oh. I thought that was the ghost. I took a picture of it and everything. There's going to be loads of pictures of just random shit on, on my phone. It's like, look, here's a picture of a bed sheet. Here's a picture of a cat. Here's a picture of what I had for dinner yesterday. I did read that this game isn't exactly linear and that there is, like, it's, it's more open. There's lots of places to explore. But there's not a lot of direction so far. Oh, he was in the locker. Andre, who are you? Please... Go away. No, Andre, you've got a key. Please. Linda? Thank God you're okay. What, you need the key? Are you crazy? She's turning psycho. Mm. Listen, I want to give it to you, but a white shadow was chasing me. I'm too scared to open this closet. I'm sorry, Linda. Okay. Hello. I see you at the window. Let's take, take your picture. Let me guess, when I go out, you're not going to be there? Nope. Thought so. You creepy son of a bitch. Where are you gone? Well, Andre, it's gone. I chased it away. It scared me. It knows me. No, I don't want to get out. A white shadow is chasing me. For God's sake, Andre, you chicken shit. Okay, where's it gone? It's got to have gone somewhere. White shadow. Oh. Kitty cat. What are you saying? Is there... Is the ghosty gob down there? Yeah, I know. You hiss at it. You tell me where to go, Kitty Cat, and we'll go fight it together. Go fight the white shadow, Kitty Cat. Where'd you go? Oh. It's in the alleyway with the... What my mate down here? He was. He's not anymore. Oh. Oh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Well, we took its picture, and it got pissed off. Oh, no. He's dead. It killed him. Oh, it's down there now. 
All right, Kitty. All right, Kitty. You sit. Stand guard. I'll take its picture and piss it off. Where are you? Ghosty gob. Ghosty gob. Oh, that's open now. Okay. I give up. Please stop it. How about no? What are you? Please. Have mercy on me. I didn't mean to chase that boy. Or caused any troubles. It's just some dark vibrations bothered me. I'm sorry, human. I'll go away now. Oh, it wasn't an evil ghost. Oh, look. Here's a jungle kung with my face. Why? Just why? How did they get my photos? Well, you forgot. Oh, that's the fake grave. Oh, and the cigarettes they were smoking while they were doing it. Fucking teenagers. Sorry, I know some of you are watching this are teenagers. You're not all bad, I promise. Right, Kitty. I have banished it. Anyway, I want to look at the uh, Ghostpedia thing. There you go. Ghostpedia. Uh, no information about ghosts and apparitions. Okay, so this is this thing here. It's a pecong. A poor soul trap a poor trapped soul, often depicted as the undead wrapped in burial shrouds, known as kafan. Although it's covered and tied over the head, under the feet and the neck with kafan, Pekong can fly and teleport. One can free the soul by untying all the bindings and it will leave the world of living forever. Yeah, so these are like urban legends, which I really like um, urban legend based games. So the fact that this game is very much based on all that kind of stuff, it makes me very happy. Which is why I want to really give it a chance. Right, Andre, you sack of shit. I got rid of the ghost. It wasn't even evil. Linda, is the thing gone? How did you do that? I have a magic millennial phone. Anyway, here's the key to the front lobby. Be careful of her, Linda. Just run for your life. Okay, school lobby key. Key which is given to Andre to open the room where the possessed Henny was locked. The fuck's a Henny? I don't know what a Henny is. Okay. Oh, it's a person. So you guys have heard about this evil Linda, right? She's the one that caused all these accidents lately. She's the absolute worst. <laughs> She's live streaming it. And Friends are dead. Ida, Selly, Yaya, Donnie, Miss Siska, D E A D, dead. What a psychotic murderer! So, just for you, fam, I'm gonna make her fam. suffer and maybe even confess. Right, that's lovely. I unlock the door with the school lobby key. Okay, where are you? Please don't ask me a question. Right, well, we can't go that way, and we can't go that way because they're blocked off, so. Straight ahead. Not that way either. That's the yeah, we're literally being funneled in one direction. Henny Oh there she is. Look, I got she finally decided to show up. Let's get this vengeance party started. Oh what the hell's that? Okay, let's just like keep running. Oh, she's slow. There we go. There's the spirit. Hello. Okay. Wait. Okay, there we go. Now we did some damage. Right, I see. I see how we fight this thing. Oh. Oh. She's live streaming this the whole time. So we'd have to do a certain amount of damage to her like this.
like that. And then the ghosty gob comes out. There we go. And then we do damage to the actual ghost with our camera. Makes sense. I just keep taking loads of pictures. There we go. Just... She's so slow. Come on, really? You gotta be stronger than that. Oh. I think it got fed up. Ow. Okay. Come on. Whoops. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. Ow. Got it. He's quick. I think when he charges at me, I should be running. But he's too quick. I can't actually dodge out the way anyway. So I'm just going to tank the damage. I don't actually seem to have a health bar as such, so... He's getting mad. There we go! Rip! <laughs> You stupid demon thing. And you? This is all your fault. And collapse. Cool, can I have your axe? No. Right, let's have a look at this. What the hell this demon thing was then. Let's have a look. Ghostpedia. Okay, it was a Karasukan victim. The Karasukan victim is possessed by a dark spirit who feeds on the negative energy from bad human emotions. So she was, like, pissed at me for everyone's death or something. The victim reported suffering the loss of motor motoric controls and experienced uncontrollable mania. The victim is finally freed from the possession. He or she will not remember any of the previous states. Fair enough. So she's just gonna... Let's, let's take some... What we should do, really, is, like, paint her... Put some, like, permanent marker on her face. Take some pictures. That'd be pretty funny, right? Well, we did it! We, we, we did it. Now what do we do? I lastly got the key. Time to get out of here. Oh, so we're just leaving. I mean, that's that's very sensible. Let's just run. Hello, janitor. Can you let me out of the gate, please? Some guys played a prank on me. And I didn't like it very much. What are you doing here? No student's supposed to be here at this hour. Go home already. Hmm. Those kids did something, didn't they? Should have torn down that cursed shack earlier. Too many nasty things happen there. You should go back home. I'll deal with the mess. Let me open the gate for you. Thank you, Mr. Janitor. We escaped! Well, looks like just walking home. At least it's nice and light here. Pretty upsetting having your mate with an axe trying to kill you. I was going to say, what you do, cry about it, but she evidently is. The next day! Yay! This is a lovely happy music. White tiger. Oh, we saw a white cat last night, like, projecting us. 
I wonder if that's going to got any significance. Imagine it has, like folklore and shit, right? Wakey, wakey, Linda! It's time to get up for another day. She slept in her school clothes. Well, I suppose if you're that, like, knackered, fighting ghosts at night, press your alarm button. That's an annoying alarm. Ugh. Right, come on, Linda. Let's sulk about the house. And when mum... There's a goat. Right, you brush your teeth. You sorted your uniform out. Yay, well done, Linda. Good on you. Oh, do we live in like a communal thing? We must do, right? Oh yeah, no one evil ever had <laughs> like hey, curlers. Landlady, off to school, eh? Don't forget to pay your rent this month. It's almost due. <laughs> oh! She whacked me in the face! I just took a pick of Go post these on Fap Chat. Stupid woman. What are you doing? Kim. Grrr! A naughty cat. She stole one of my shoes. Where the hell is she? I swear I'll give her nasty... Good morning, Linda. Sorry, I didn't know she's standing there. What? You want to borrow my backpack? Sure, I could do that. I'll let you even have it if we find my shoe. Please, my boyfriend bought that for me. Oh my god, have we got a fetch quest? Okay, I wasn't expecting a fetch quest. I guess the last one was a fetch quest. It's not so spooky anymore. It's got some really happy music. We could have an interlude before things go to shit again, I guess. That's well, kind of cool that it's like a, you know, an actual city with stuff in it. I wonder if we can actually get run over. Run me over! Do it! Do it! You bastard. <gasps> there it is. I found it. Hey, kitty cat. Let's some evidence that I found the cat with the shoe. And there's a woman with a broom. Um, no. I'm not touching this cat. Right, excuse me. Huh. You troublemaker. Always making a mess. Made me work harder. What are you playing with today? Shoe? Huh? How are you? Is it yours? Fair warning, don't try and take it by force. She bit off a guy's finger last- Whoa! Savage cat. Last time I heard, he had his finger amputated. This lady over there here is such a diva. She's only interested in eating Pacellele. Maybe you can lure her with that. That reminds me, I haven't had my breakfast today. Play a Pacellele would be nice. Right. Right, we're doing fetch quest shit. This city here is actually pretty big. I've just wandered around for a little bit. Oh, uh, 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 yes! You can get hit by the... <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but I just wanted to see if you actually could or not. <laughs> Ooh, I found a cafe. Ah, is this the place? Sorry, miss. We're not. Is that for the street sweeper lady? She wants two portions. No problem. There you go. Two percent of LA. They're on the house. Um, please tell her that every day would be brighter if she would smile more often. Okay. A fried catfish and some ballet pass pestle condiment. I kind of with fried tofu or tempeh and usually eaten with steamed rice. It's a popular di dish, Javanese dish, widely consumed in many Indonesian cultures. Okay, well, I've had a culture lesson and also I got lost for 10 minutes and ended up finding this alleyway. Tonal shift in the game. Right, eager love, eager cat, I got you some food. Enjoy. Hey, you bought two? Thank you. Here you go, enjoy your food, naughty girl. Yeah, I got the sh I got the, the shoe. Yay! Right, I found your shoe. Here you go. Thanks, Lynn. Yeah, you got it. Thanks, Linda. As promised, here's my backpack. Now, it's time to go. I'm already late. Sniff, sniff. Why, you little furry? Did you really have to pee in my sh- oh -ha. Oh -ha. Okay, we got our backpack. Now what? Yay, I got a new backpack. Time to go to school. I hope I can make it on time. It's 10 o'clock. What time do you start school? In this country, it's like... Quarter to nine or something like that? Okay, here we go. So now we just... Oh, we just travel to the school using our phone. That's the easy way of doing it. We don't actually have to run anywhere. I was looking around thinking, where am I actually going? But, you know, that's cool. We just use our phone for everything. But the janitor's cleaned up everything. I'm going to be happy again now. 
Here we go. We made it to school. And it looks a lot nicer than it did yesterday. I'll tell you that. Hell of a lot nicer. Anyway, Janet, dude. Just want to say thank you for yesterday. How you been? Me? Same old, same old. About that instant yesterday. Don't worry, my lips are sealed. Yeah, they better be, mate. Because if they're not... I don't know what I'll do. I'll, I'll take pictures of you. Uh, Linda, Melinda. Miss Belinda, I've been looking for you. There's a question I'd like to ask. Three of your classmates were injured by unknown causes. Did you know something about those incidents? Some students claim to see you come here at late hours. What? You don't know? Strange. Okay, listen from today. When all your classes are finished, do not stay late at this place. Go home immediately. I've received reports about strange supernatural incidents at this school lately. Then close it! Holy shit! Now go to your class. You're already late. Alright. Thanks. Whoever the hell you are. Wow, it looks a lot nicer during the day when it's not covered in, like, whatever, like, mist and blood and guts and shit. And here we go. This is your classroom, right? My seat. Should I sit and wait for class to start? Yes, why would we not? We want to get back to the horror! And stop playing this for high school simulator. <clears throat> there we go. Finally. Well, what are we learning about today? Hopefully no one heard the phone going off. It's quite loud! Teacher don't really seem that bothered by it though. Shh, just don't hide it! Make some effort to hide it! Oh, what is. Oh, well, okay. The horror's back! Woo! You probably should have had it on silent. Or switched off. Just saying. We can't actually turn our flashlight on. Or do anything. We could just move. Um, hello? But this is where the teacher was standing. Miss Siska? The person responsible for everything. What? Oh, um, um. What did Miss Siska do? Oh, he's convulsing. Holy shit. And. She's, she's hanging from the fan! Just going round and round! That's not funny, but it is simply funny! Okay, that happened. Good morning, class. I'm so pleased to meet you all. Yeah. I'm Mariska Gandasasmita. You can call me Miss Siska. Okay. I'll be your teacher today. Okay. Lovely. And I hope we can all get along nicely. Probably not, though, right? With all the screaming and shit. Act one. Rest. Cheesh. The camera doesn't work. Oh. That shit. How am I supposed to take pictures of stuff then? And now there's blood and bodies and shit everywhere. I don't think this is my classroom anymore somehow. No, this this looks like some type of alternate fleshy dimension. Gotta love a good alternate fleshy dimension, right? This is just empty! So they couldn't even be bothered to put the classroom stuff in there. Way you model the school fleshy dimension. What the fuck is this? This looks like a mine shaft. Oh, hell oh, there. Yeah. Lovely. It's just body piles everywhere. Love a good body pile, me. Oh, this classroom looks fine. It's actually slightly normal. But this one. Yeah, that one's fine too. I'm going upstairs. 
Oh, hello. Who are you? Yo, kenapa masih jalan-jalan? What are you doing wandering around like that? Class already started. Please sit down. Um, there's literally only me here. But sure. What are we learning? Math? Fucking hate math. Kita mulai ya sekarang. It's like horror in itself. In 1982, a dark vortex was imploding in the inner circle of the Magnus constellation. This included a magnet. Therefore, our Earth side vibrating in a way that she established the milliseconds of gyro. I guess. I can't read this. It's too fast. Accumulation of interest energy suggests an of globular Pandora universe. I don't think I'm supposed to follow. He's looking at me funny. Don't look at me like that. No, 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 no. No phone in my class. Kids, these. I'll have my phone back. Thank you. You're a demon, aren't you? I'm just gonna, like, leave. If that's alright. I'm assuming it's like, like... What's it? You! You're one of them! Stay away, please! Don't focus too much on your phone. That light, it burns! Okay. Well, my light's on. Hold F to flashlight stun. Get fucked, mate. Look at you! Oh! Oh, we actually have... We have threat now. Okay. Okay, we need to get past, and he's blocking the way. There we go. Let's, let's, just, let's just leave. Because we can't, like, do anything, really. Apart from run. We guess there's going to be more of them now. Okay, this is open. I thought it was going to be, like, locked in. Let's just run. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> he was not happy with me, though. I don't know what the hell he was. Why can't it be added to my ghost thingy? Let's get back to my normal classroom. No, there's nothing in here. I mean, the good thing is he doesn't leave the classroom. When you just leave, he just goes back to where he was before. So it's going to be something else. Only downside of this game so far is the direction is very much lacking. Oh, hang on a minute. This is... The teacher told me about focusing my phone and light. See, it, it, this... If, unless I came up to this, I wouldn't have known. Oh, okay. What the hell is that? Oh! Ow! It was a shanky thing! Okay, stun it and run. Oh, the door is closed. Okay. Hi! How are you doing? You look possessed. You were possessed. Oh, now there's, there's, there's loads of them. Great. Get stunned, mate. I see the kitty cat. I see the kitty cat. Hey, kitty cat. How's it going? What have you... Is that a knife? It's you again. Why are you helping me? Who are you? Oh, he's giving me a knife. Am I not actually going to be using my phone anymore? Oh no, we actually have combat. So we're not taking pictures of shit anymore. Okay, this this went very different. Okay. Oh, we're just slicing up shit. What the hell is going on? Padlock. Shank it? No. Oh! Ow! Right, okay, we've got a fight. An actual fight. Stun. Shank. Shank. Run. Stun. S stab it in the bloody chest! Just he's repeatedly stabbed the thing in the chest. I don't know, this is kind of cool. Ow! Get shanked! Repeatedly. Eventually you'll die. Oh, she has a key. Oh. Oh, right. 
Look at you! You're bigger! How many hits do they take? So I hit them four times. They take a lot of hits. That's cool, we just keep... Okay, he's dead. New Ghostpedia entry, sweet! This game's a lot different than I was expecting. Again, I was expecting more photographing. Okay, that one's dead. What about you? Chunky boy? Oh, there we go. Stab him in the gut repeatedly. Uh, I think we do it with we hold it? Okay, no. That doesn't work. We'll just click. Click and stab. Rip Chunky boy. <laughs> and fall down. Right. Is the boss going to come back now? Come on, back you come. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, the padlock's gone. What is this? Devil may fucking cry? I'm back! And not completely covered. In Hi, guys! <laughs> How's it going? Everyone's shocked that I'm literally soaked in blood. I'm getting expelled. <laughs> Well, okay. That was, uh, that was something. I think Linda should check herself to the hospital, ma'am. Yeah, look at the state of me. Of course, Mr. Matt. I'll tell her to go there immediately. Thank you, sir. I'm so sorry for the troubles. Oh, hey, landlady with a mallet. <laughs> Brat! What did you do? I know that's not your blood. You're lucky I don't call the police. Wear a jacket or something. You'll make a ruckus looking like this. Alright. Sorry, love. I'll change my clothes. I'm still bloody! I'm still covered in blood! Let's go get washed up. Can we get washed up? No, we're just going to walk out covered in blood. Oh, our phone works now. Okay. Right, let's have a look. To-do list. Nothing. Oh, there's a hospital. Oh, we can go to- this is like the in-between section, right? Okay, so have a look at this ghost. It's Dreadlings. Dreadlings originated from the Jirakong, the living dead skeletal ghosts who devour eggs to prolong their lives. The Jirakong evolves in more dangerous, ungodly hybrid Dreadlings when their tainted souls and Blorong's essences unite. Cool. Okay, so I've got to go to the hospital. So let's get the bike taxi to the hospital and teleport. I mean, no one's gonna like look at me funny if I'm like, walking in covered in blood. It's like, hi, I'm really sorry. Find your doctor, take your number. Oh, number 205. Take a seat, we will attend you shortly. Okay, sure. Let's, ha let's sit down. What number? 106. This gonna take fucking ages. Oh no, 107. Oh, uh, I bet we're gonna like. Yeah, I thought so. We're gonna like shift between worlds again, aren't we? No, 204. Oh, she's falling asleep. You're 205, love. Wake up. You're next. There we go. 205. Wake up. Two, zero, five. That's me. Except everybody's gone. So this obviously isn't the same hospital we were before. Oh, and it is. The receptionist is there. Tall. Okay. We just, we were literally here all day to the point it's now dark. Hi, I'm 205. Miss Linda, Melinda. You may go to Dr. Sakadmi room. Just go through the pool. <laughs> this is too many words. I don't understand. Oh, plink. <laughs> I'm so sorry. If anyone does speak Indonesian, I'm butchering your language. Okay, here we go. I guess it's like the clinic. Alright, kid. Oh, God. Creepy children. Shush. Don't run. Walk very slowly. He can't see me. He can't see. Who can't see? Hello, I've come to... I've got an appointment. You gonna let me in? Oh, maybe we go this way. Ah, here he is. Hello, doctor. Oh, hmm, wait a moment. Please take a seat. Okay, I mean, you're looking at your phone. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? Oh, he's staring at the lock screen. 
you're not really doing much, are you, mate? Fine. I'll have a seat. It's just like, mm, this lock screen is very interesting. Yes, yes, look at this. Look at these apps I've downloaded. Where, where are you going? Oh, hi. Hey, dead ghost girl. How's it going? We're just gonna we're just gonna sit here. We can't move. She's just gonna. That's I mean, that's his daughter. Look, there's the doctor, and that's that must be her, right? Why is there a body bag in here? Oh God, here we go. Oh, hi. Hey, um, is this just like a timed thing? Probably is right. I can't move or do anything. What if I don't look at her? No, she's still there. Linda. Linda. Oh, she's got very long, grabby hands. There's something you can do. Right. Die. She's breaking my neck. Listen. Oh, I was gonna say. Die. Listen. Alright, Navi. This the this is messed up. I don't quite understand what's going on. It's really like it's it's interesting, it's really interesting, but it's kind of janky at the same time. <laughs> Oh, here we go. I knew things were going to go to shit. Well, the hospital is now very dark and kind of manky. Oh, lovely. Hello there. I see you. Hi, how's it going? Cool. I'm going to leave this here for today. I've been playing for over an hour now. And uh, yeah, let me know what you thought of the game in the comment section below and whether you want me to play any more. But thank you all so much for watching. As I said, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, please don't forget to leave this video a like. Also, if you haven't already, subscribe for new daily videos. And I'll see you again soon.